Hello and namaste. It's Jewel from Goddess Creative. Whoa. <laughs> what a week it's been. Okay. First of all, I'd like to say how really bad the lighting is in this villa. I've been running around all over the show. Uh, that little white fluffy thing over there, that's my new puppy. This is Lovey. Excuse her, she's doing a wee. Um, I'll introduce you in a minute. Uh, you would have heard the, her bell um, in a lot of my videos. So, yeah. Lovey, come here. We've just put in new paving this week, so to try and stop her from getting so muddy. Um, yeah, so it's been a it's been a very busy week. This is lovely. Yes, so pretty cute, isn't she? Yeah my new little distraction um it's been a busy week it's been a very social week um and a lot's been going on um i had a wedding to go to which was really really nice so it was friends of mine a german guy and an indonesian girl gorgeous gorgeous couple and yeah they finally tied the knot so love was in the air which is really really nice um, and also had a friend's birthday party so that was really nice so a lot of social stuff um, which you know can be big distractions and slow me down with what I'm doing I also the universe has thrown at me also this week a uh, really bad toothache and so I ended up with a root canal and so I also ended up with a bruised eye. Yes, that was totally unexpected. I didn't expect that. But um, such is life. Um, thankful it is. it happened in Bali and that I'm in Bali because dental is really reasonably priced here in Bali compared to Australia. So yeah, a lot, a lot cheaper. So, which is great. I had, um, dental's actually really good here. I had a root canal and a crown done probably about 10 years ago here. And then it cost me around about 50 million, which is about five million, sorry. Sorry, not 50 million, five million which is around about $500 for a crown, which is really cheap, because uh, in Australia I'd be paying like 5,000. So now the prices have gone up a little bit, but um, I'm in the, pro I've just done the root canal, and um, so there was a lot to it, it was a big one. It would have had three roots in this big tooth at the back here, hence the reason why I got bruising. Um, and, the and I'm at the stage now where I'm waiting to see if I can have the crown, if this root canal is going to settle down and not be um, flare up. Um, they've treated it and everything like that. So I've got to wait. I've got to wait a month or two to see if um, it settles down and then I can have a root canal. So um, I'm sorry, then I can have a crown. So crowns here in Bali are around about six million now, which is about six hundred dollars. Um, which is so much cheaper than Australia. Um, even your fillings and all that. Your fillings here are about 50,000, which is like, I'm just trying to give you an idea of what the difference in price is. Um, so that's about $50 Australian. I'm talking Australian. So back home, they're 150, starting 150, maybe 175. To go and see a dentist and have like just normal filling no no root canals or anything like that so yeah and i must say that dental is world class here it is really really good so yeah just a heads up <laughs> um yeah so this is uh, a little update and um it's really nice to see the market back up again i I did a little check-in today and the market is going up, can go into, particularly the altcoin market will continue to go a bit higher. 
I did a reading for Bitcoin, um, which will be, you'll be able to access this once I release this new book. I'm nearly, I'm getting so close. <laughs> I'm not quite there yet, but I'm getting closer. Um, the reason why this book is going to be a lot of fun is it's going to have um, information in it that will, it'll have QR codes that will link to all my readings for the particular altcoin. I'm putting Bitcoin in it. Um, so it's more like a um, financial markets book. It, it does have a lot of cryptocurrency. It's predominantly cryptocurrency, but it'll also have precious metals in it. And it's coming soon. Um, so I'll tell you more about that when I'm closer, but I'm, I'm, I'm getting there. As I said, I've had a lot of distractions, a lot of social events. So, which have been lovely, and um, yes, this little girl, um, her name is Lovey. She's been a distraction, haven't you, Lovey? Yes, darling. Yes. Um, so, about to go out for her and get some more food, and um, yeah, she goes on my scooter, so it's pretty cute. Um, she goes in a little backpack. Yeah. Um, so, oh yeah, so I've, I've, I'm reading Bitcoin and with regards to reading Bitcoin, so I do get that it has a wee bit more in it for this year, just a little bit, not much, like it's already had a big jump, um, but it won't be until next year, next year that it will start to move. But in the meantime, um, while Bitcoin settles and goes sideways, the alts will come closer to some of the predictions that I've had for them for the timeline of 2023. So I'm still getting there going and yeah, the timeline's definitely moving. It's so hard to, you know, get a timeline to stay and be set in stone. As we know, there is many timelines all moving um, simultaneously alongside each other and the timeline I'm hooking in for these particular old coins hasn't quite come to pass yet, but it will. I'm getting it will. Okay, so that's very interesting. And yeah, it is lovely to see some of these alts still moving up. I would like to say thank you very much for your support and your orders lately. Um, it's really nice to see some really old clients come back again and that's lovely um, that's been happening I've been doing some old coin readings as well in my and some personal readings so that's what's going on with me I just wanted to check in for you wanting to make this short and sweet and want it to carry on too long so yeah this is just a, a little check-in and uh, to let you know what's going on I also wanted to mention, so as far as my, um, just to touch on the video that I did last week, which was on health. So this week, just to let you know what I'm doing, I'm currently doing a fast. So what a fast does is it, it does actually kick in autophagy, which kicks in, um, your your body's ability to heal itself naturally so i'm on the 18 hour what is it now one nearly one o'clock and i stopped eating at 7 p.m last night so i'm currently on an 18 hour window of not eating anything because it's nearly one o'clock here um and i hope to go definitely um the 24 I might go longer and might go to tomorrow so we'll have to see how that goes um, why do we do this uh, there's there's information all over the internet I'm sure you already know about fasting and how good it is for you kicks in your natural human growth hormone it also kicks in your body's um, ability to heal itself and because I'd gone through cold and then I'd gone through what did I have Oh, just a few different things and now and then the, um, the root canal thing I just want to really um, kick in my body's natural ability to start healing itself I um, also have been eating too much sugar 
and when I came back from Australia, I brought all these chocolate bars back that you can't get here. And yeah, I have been eating them all. So I am um, going to, and I'm hoping, yeah, that it's gonna help with my thyroid. <clears throat> and I noticed I've still got a bit of a croaky voice. So I, hopefully that'll clear. I'm, yeah, going to see how that goes and I'll, I'll let you know. It's worth a try, hey. I've done it before. It's, it's not fun when you're doing it, but normally I, it's not until day two or day three that it kicks in the actual euphoria part of it. But um, I think it's day three, euphoria kicks in, which I'm not experiencing just yet. But anyway, <laughs> so yeah, I thought I'd let you know about that. We'll keep you updated. We'll keep you updated when this um, book is nearly finished and I'm hoping it's going to be very, very soon. But yeah, I'm super excited about it because it is a real um, collection of my work that I hope to do a few of them. It'll be available on Amazon. Yeah, that's exciting. Okay, all right, so I'm gonna leave it there for the moment. I hope you're all well. So please at the market it has moved up again and things are starting to move again. We are on the second half of the year now. It's super exciting, lots is happening. And just before we know it, we'll be, you know, at the end of the year and moving into next year. So it's just, I cannot get over how fast this time is moving. Okay, I'm going to leave it there. Namaste.